Placing and connecting branches is done once air terminals, equipment, and main duct runs are placed. To place branches, draw a section of round ductwork. Pick the Home tab. Under HVAC, select the duct on the panel. On the Type selector, pick Round Duct, Taps. Set the offset to be equal to the offset of the mains. In this case, 10 feet 6 inches or 315 centimeters. It is often helpful to place a section of ductwork to be used as a branch and then duplicate it multiple times. Often, I will center the branch ductwork of the center line of the diffuser using the Align tool in the Modify tab. To connect the diffuser to the branch, draw a section of flex ductwork connecting the diffuser to the branch. To place flex ductwork, select the Home tab. Under the HVAC panel, select Flex Duct. Then snap to the duct end, pressing spacebar to take on the properties of the round duct branch. Best practice, of course, is to keep the flex as short and straight as possible. Also recall that a flex duct maximum length can be set in the MEP settings. Note how the branch changes color as the filter reads the named system and applies the color cyan to the ductwork. To connect to the main, simply extend the branch. Under the Modify tab in the Modify panel, select Trim slash Extend, select the duct to connect to, then the duct you wish to connect. Once these are placed and connected, query the duct. Selecting it, scroll down in the Properties palette to CFM and verify that it is indeed holding airflow.